I'm Melissa, the founder of ProudDogMom.com. Welcome back to my channel. All right, I am beyond excited to share with you my newest dog treat creation. And to be honest, I haven't been this excited about a dog treat in a really long time. So we are gonna be making these jiggly little guys right here. They are chicken flavored jello that I have shaped into little dog bones. They are so cute, so much fun to make so tasty for our dogs and also so healthy. They have ingredients in them that are great for their joint health, their bones, digestion, gut health, hair, skin, nails. I can't wait to tell you all about it. Just a quick disclaimer before we get into the real recipe though, don't go into your local grocery store and pick up some Jello or gummies and give them to your dog. They have other ingredients in them that aren't okay for your dog's health. These on the other hand are made with just a few ingredients that are all dog approved. I promise they're gonna love them. All right, let's get cooking. Start by gathering all of your ingredients. For these jiggly chicken jello bites, you're gonna need a quarter pound of chicken breast, one large carrot, which is washed, peeled, and chopped, one sprig of parsley, just the leaves, you can ditch those stems, some water, and we're gonna talk about the amount in just a minute, and one packet of Knox plain, unflavored, and unsweetened gelatin powder. All right, pop that chicken, carrot, and parsley into a pot, add enough water to cover it all, and turn your burner on to a medium-high heat. You'll let this go for 30 minutes to cook the chicken, soften the carrots, and really infuse the water with some great chicken flavor. Once your timer goes off, move the chicken and carrots into a blender and puree. Set that aside for a minute and measure out half a cup of freshly made chicken broth. Now it's into a mixing bowl and time to whisk in that packet of, once again, unflavored and unsweetened gelatin. This stuff offers really great health benefits and it's what's going to give our treats that jello-y texture. Once that gelatin is fully dissolved, mix in the pureed chicken and carrot. You'll be left with a gravy-like texture. It's time to grab a silicone mold, place it on top of a baking sheet for support, and then simply spoon your mixture into the mold. These go into the refrigerator for one to two hours or until fully set. So once your treats are fully set in the refrigerator, they release from their molds really easily. And of course, again, this is what they look like, really, really jello-y. And while these are so much fun, these are the guys who are really having fun because they wait for it and they love this stuff. The first time I gave it to them, I was so excited to see their reaction. They chew it very easily, they swallow it really easily, and they would stay here all day if you let them eat it. So I hope that your dogs love these just as much as mine do. If you like the recipe, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And before you go, hit that little bell so that way you get notified every single time I post a new video. Enjoy.